Thank you. Let's end all. Feature uh, Elijah Johnson on tenor saxophone. Jared Grove on baritone saxophone. Sean Carroll on bass. Peter Ferguson on guitar. So for the next tune, I would like to invite Miss Jillian Womax to join us. And as she's on her way up, um, as I was doing a little research on um, What a Wonderful World, most of you know it is being sung by Louis Armstrong. But after a little research, it turns out that, A, it wasn't as old, the song is not as old as I thought it was. It was only 1967 when it was composed, and that it was not written by Louis Armstrong. But since Louis Armstrong made it famous, and he's definitely one that was around during the Harlem Renaissance, that's why I chose the program. Is. So right now, here's our rendition of What a Wonderful World. Jillian Lomax, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so next on the program, going back to Charlie Parker, once again, um, influenced very much by the Harlem Renaissance. And this one is, um, well, actually, the other Yarbrough suite is fast, too. But now, uh, another booze bop. Uh, this is Billy's Bounce.
Thank you. That was Billy's Bounce. Featuring once again Elijah Johnson on tenor saxophone. Jared Grove on baritone saxophone. Sean Carroll on bass. Peter Ferguson on guitar. And Professor Thomas Spann Jr. on drum set. Okay, so <clears throat> we're going to slow it down. This next song, Yesterdays, I first learned about it when I was an undergraduate student. Uh, took a jazz improv class. So that was, in fact, actually Satin Doll. I also had played that in a jazz improv class. And so basically both of those have really been <coughs> in the Fifth Jazz Ensemble Library for quite a while. But then after more research, it turns out that that piece came out during the Harlem Renaissance. Um, at any rate, here is our rendition of Yesterdays. Thank you. 
Thank you. That was yesterday's featuring Elijah Johnson, tenor saxophone. <laughs> Kara Grove on the Barry saxophone. <laughs> Sean Carroll on the bass. Peter Ferguson on the guitar. Okay, now this next song is fairly recent. In fact, I'm thinking it was definitely around 2012 or 2013 when it was written. Back, no, that makes the song so short. When I first came here in 2003, one of the things I was I did. I would bring in a visiting guest artist, usually someone I knew really well, in fact, sometimes someone I went to school with. Then around 2012, I decided, well, that's when I discovered there was a lot of talent in the industry. And so I would invite high school, middle school bands, these best visiting guest artists. My very second group was the McKissick Middle School Jazz Ensemble. Um, now the conductor there, Emir Santiago, he's um, in Miami now. But um, yeah, he was in Nashville for a few years. And that very same year we collaborated with him, they also had a jazz festival, in which they invited us to. In fact, we ended up being the future, the future group. And right before the Fizz Jazz Ensemble played, there was a faculty jazz ensemble. And we did several of his own tunes. One of them was this tune here, Reminiscence. Um, it's a rather <coughs> up-tempo tune. And I also, actually what really intrigued me to play it, not only the fact that I was involved in that faculty group that presented it, but I happened to hear it on the radio on, I believe it was WFSK, not too long after that. So anyway, here is our rendition of Reminiscence by Emir Santiago.
you. That was Reminiscence by Emir Santiago, featuring again Elijah Johnson on the tenor saxophone, <laughs> Jerry Grove on the berry saxophone. In case you're wondering, so I have not introduced Miss Ardria McDonald on the flute yet, but she'll be featured on the next two tunes for sure. But anyway, I'll share as well. <laughs> okay, so um, due to unforeseen circumstances, we will not be doing I'm Coming Out. In its place, we will do one of our favorites, which is I Want You by Marvin Gaye. Um, that has actually been in our books since 2006. Um, <clears throat> and it was about probably 2012 when we were doing it, I won't say on all our performances, but definitely when we do receptions and then other items. Um, this is the first time it's been on an actual concert about six or seven years. Anyway, this is our rendition of I Want You by Marvin Gaye. It'll feature everyone but PM.
Thank you. Once again, Artery McDonald, flute. <laughs> Elijah Johnson, tenor saxophone. Jared Grove, Barry saxophone. Sean Carroll, bass. Peter Ferguson, guitar. Professor Thomas Band, drum set. And we're going to close the program with good old fashioned blues. This back once again, going back to Harlem Renaissance. This is Duke Ellington's Sea Jam Blues.
Thank you. Coming.